The final skater takes the ice here in the Ladies Short program, Yebin Mock from Los Angeles, California, only 18 years old. This is her third trip to the Senior National Championships, and she is at top 10 finishes the first two trips. And nerves have gotten to her in the past. We'll see if she can hold it together and complete all of these eight required elements in this short program. Her opening move is a triple lutz, double toe, reaching back there. Nice spring. What a gentle entrance into that jump. No strain to it, no pain at all. And yet it was a lovely, lovely performance. I mean, that's, that's really very nice to see. Very pretty triple loop. We don't see many triple loops when they choose to pick a triple jump. Triple loop is actually harder than either the triple toe or some of the other moves, and that's an unusual one, uh, not, not often seen. And I think it suits this music so well. An edge jump is, is less jarring, really flows with this music. Devin Mock was born in Seoul, South Korea, and came to the U.S. in 1992. Said, she, said it was very difficult at first because she didn't know a word of English, but she picked it up in about seven months. Her father's company relocated him, and that's why the family came to the U.S. and settled on the West Coast. position very nicely done you know we've seen some really nice performances tonight some really good performances all the way around and a standing ovation Yevin Mock bringing them out of their seats here in Dallas the final <laughs> skater here in the ladies short you know, I can't wait to see what's going to happen in the free program when the programs are twice as long and twice as difficult. The two jump combination, a triple lutz, triple toe, double toe rather, good height, straight legs, very good back position, easy turning around to the next one. You know, just an, an elegant and complete and uh, very gentle jump combination. You know that moment when Sarah Hughes at the Olympics turned around and looked back at the crowd and what she had done? It was that kind of, I know this isn't the Olympics, but it was that kind of moment, a standing oh. ovation at the national championships. Required elements, there they are. Those are nice, those are nice marks. They're very steady and very secure and well-deserved. Presentation now, Peggy, 5-2 to 5-6. And she was lovely. I, I wish she would maybe do that number with a little more conviction, but it's just such gorgeous music, and she did such a great job. Yevin Mox, best finish at Nationals, 10th. She did that twice. Right now, she goes into fifth place. So here's a look at your standings heading into the free skate. Michelle Kwan was brilliant. She hadn't competed since October, but the layoff did her some good. Sasha Cohen right behind in second, and... Sarah Hughes rounding out the top three. All three of those, if either one wins the free skate, whoever wins it, they win the gold medal. Right now, the leader, Michelle Kwan, is standing by with Peter Curry.